Dr. Zenobia James, better known as Dr. Z. My response to the central question for this week's session, week three, people with high IQs are good language learners. This is what I learned. According to Maya about in 2016, her article states on the assumptions people with high IQs are good language learners. She says that individuals do not need to be extra smart to learn a language because everyone can learn when they are given the chance and are guided by a teacher who can provide students with the necessary strategies to practice and gain confidence when learning. Furthermore, Camilla Lopez, I may not be saying the words correctly, but you can see it on the reference, says that people with high IQs may have an advantage in memorizing grammar rules and vocabulary, but not in learning the use of language. As a matter of fact, one of the most important factors in second language acquisition is motivation because motivation increases success and success also increases motivation. Not only this, but a transcript of second language acquisition slash learning by Act. Uh, Atkins and Marino said that it is a false statement that people with higher IQs are necessarily good language learners, although some of them may develop a second language easier than others or have a deeper interest in learning things. Therefore, they are more dedicated to learning and may achieve second language acquisition faster than a person who isn't very interested in learning. However, their IQ does not necessarily mean that it will be easier. Finally, we share Van Squats, Guan's personal and agonizing experience trying to learn German and although Vincois was a smart college professor, his techniques prevented him from learning a language. Vincois was smart, but foolish. His smarts made him so smart, did not make him so smart. As a result, his language learning strategies were not effective. Research has shown that language learners who employ good language strategies, specifically predicting, using selective attention, preparing, looking ridiculous, practicing, monitoring, asking questions, taking notes, using imagery, finding imagery, finding answer in multiple ways, using physical response and playing, which is experimenting with languages, are more probable to acquire a second language. Dr. Z.